we have crews across the state monitoring the current conditions to keep you safe. And right now we want to get out to our Haley Wagger, who is live in downtown Oklahoma City. And Haley, I imagine it was a lot rougher this morning. How are the roads out there now? Well, the big change that I'm seeing right now is the sun is trying to come out, so it makes this a lot more bearable, but I'm here right next to I-40, as you can see behind me. The roads really aren't bad, and it was the same thing. I was out in Norman, same thing with 35. There's some ice on the shoulder, but it's really not until you get to some of those city streets or even just the sidewalks that you'll start to see some of that ice and some of that frozen sleet. But again, you're just going to want to be cautious if you're out on the road today at all. I've been talking with the Oklahoma Department Department of Transportation all day long. They pre-treated the roads before the weather came in. They've continued working in 12-hour on-call shifts, over 500 crew members across the state. ODOT saying it's, again, best to stay off the roads altogether. If you do have to be out, you can check their app, Drive Oklahoma, or look at okroads.gov to check your route. You can see real-time road conditions, kind of see how things are looking. You can see um, that we have cameras on the front of our snow plows, so you can actually see what roads look like as they were going through uh, the area. Oda also saying even if the roads look clear and dry, there could be some slick spots, so keep it safe and drive slow if you're out on the road today. Live in Oklahoma City, Haley Wager, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.